a very simple vlog today um, because we're a bit tired, aren't we? We've been at it all day working. I'm knackered. We've been product testing at Partridge Lakes. Lovely Partridge Lakes. What lake's Lovely. this? This is Holbar Lake. It's a specimen one. Specimen. It's got some big carps in it. What, big, big what's the poten What's the potentially the biggest we're going to catch tonight? 50 pounders in here, mate. 100 Loads. pound carp. 100 pounds. <laughs> Loads of them. Loads of them. No, I think they go to about 25 pound. I think that's about like the biggest one. Yeah. But the average stamp of fishing here is like 10 pound plus. Hippos. So the nice fish. We've got a few hours in the evening after a busy day. Looking forward to bagging a few down the edge. Margin special slide on slide on forgot to say folks this is dave dave say hello evening you're hello, on the dave. vlog this is our um this is our product man folks he's the man behind all the special carbon and all that jazz um and he's been out doing some testing with us today so you're going to have a go down the edge yeah once you line them up i'll have a go once you've got it sorted you sound like you're not from round here i'm not you're from scotland but further north Aye, oh, stop throwing stuff out there. <laughs> Give me your best Scottish accent. Hi, my name's Davey. I love haggis in the morning. <laughs> and I talk really angrily <laughs> every time I talk. Oh, idiot. Come on then, kicking off. We'll let you start first. What are you going to feed? Today, I am going to be feeding ground bait. Oh, this is a I'm ground bait. Feed ground bait. Um, any any secret mix? No secret mix. I really like the margin mix from Mainline Match with a little bit of Green Supreme. I just like a greeny coloured mix. It's full of particles. It's full Look of big at that. Particles, big like big bits of pellet, bit of hemp. But I just like green. I think fish. That's a bit green, isn't it? So it's not going to be too dissimilar to what that colour is. And how much? I'm going to put a little bit of corn in. Cause that's what I'm going to put on the hook. Oh, lost my focus. There you go. Right, I'm gonna yeah. Put a few grains of corn. On. I'm going to put two on the hook to start with. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to put two big pots full of ground bait, a little sand castle them in. So the reason why the ground bait might look damp and heavy, it's really important because you've got to stay on the bottom when it goes down. Okay. You don't want it wafting about everywhere. So this is what it's going to do. Turn the pot over, go sand castle in, oh. go down in one big pot. And a few little samples. Yeah. Go on then, get her in brother. I'm going to put two in, down that side. Got okay. Them. to the beach, Matthew. So I fed my edge, giving it a bit of time to prime up. What are you going to do? I'm going to feed exactly the same, but you know, for a bit of fun, because we're having a bit of fun after work. I'm having some fun, mate. I'm having, I'm having some fun. great fun, mate. Having, I can't stop laughing, mate. Mm -hmm. You weirdo. I'm going to see if I can catch one right in here. I think I will. Mm, potentially, yeah. Literally, like, you not. not getting any more margin than that, are you? I think you will. You reckon? Well, I'll tell you what, you know a place like Woodlands Thirst, they used to start down right there, because that's where the fish were like, just kicking about. And then as soon as they caught a fish, they'd put the keep nets in Get afterwards. away. Honestly, yeah. What a tactic. Tactic. You like me new art? It's a nice tactic. Nice, isn't there. it? You notice how I've got this one? Yeah. They all call me the magpie. Yeah. Yeah. Um, what I'm going to say to you, I'm going to tell you something there. Is it a secret? It's a good time to fish down edge in the evening, isn't it? It's got to be, and look at the way the wind is. Up, everyone throws the bait in the edge, so I think I'm going to get one there. Well, you will. And what's important about this wind? Uh, it's blowy. It is blowy, and it's quite cold. Yeah. No, it's not. It's lovely. It's, a, it's actually a southerly wind. What you find with margin fishing, folks, is um, in the summer, Obviously, when you've got a warm wind, a westerly or a southerly or a southwesterly, the fish tend to get on the end of it. Yeah, so, yeah, whichever yeah. way the wind's blowing, generally, if you want to go and have a margin afternoon session, sit with the wind blowing in, it's nice and warm, fish will come close, and you should catch a few. Vice a versa, of if you're in a match and you've got wind blowing in throughout the day, perfect opportunity to catch a lot down the edge of it. Very good opportunity. Right, catch one down there. Next cut away will be him playing a big fish from there. They're in. Don't want that. They're on there. Seen it kicking all the mud up. Shh. Probably a perch. I can go get one there. If you get one there with me filming like this, I'll eat my. If I get one here, are you buying beers tonight? I'll buy you a beer. Be excited if he goes out. Will be very excited. Might have to add some sections very quickly. Yeah, I think you will. I think you can get one. Come on. I'm going to go this side. Quiet. I think he's going to get one. Yeah. 
<laughs> Carolina. Lina. Lina. I hurt feeding is a must. <laughs> Like a gnome, <laughs> Merrin. This is very good depth. Did we get one there? Do you reckon? Yeah, definitely. You've just had a massive line. Probably. You know what? Stuff stuck in the line, look. That's fluff, innit? What is it? That goo. You been gooing up? Right zoomed in here. Oh, yeah. Mm. Be good if you get one now. <gasps> oh. Oof. Scared. Don't be scared, mate. I'm here to protect you. That's positive, though. I'm glad you've had an instant fight sound. It's a good time of day, isn't it? Yeah. Nice warm wind blowing. Might sound like we have got this one more. What happened? Not a lot. <laughs> Not a lot of success there. I think we need to reassess. You lose it. Refeed. And then back in. You lose it? No, I didn't lose it. I just didn't get it. Oh. Oh, you hooked it? Yeah, I think I did hook it. You did hook it? Yeah, I think I lost it. You did lose I it. I did lose it, didn't I? <laughs> you lose it. I did lose it. At least it's not on camera. <laughs> you lose it, didn't it? Yeah, we've got a big, 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 massive whale coming in now. That were only a little one. Oh. No default tips. film you because you're filming me. Mate, I'm like a foot away from it. Imagine if I just rolled in or something like that. <laughs> It'd be funny, wouldn't it, if I fell? I just jumped in. Kadoosh! You took your car. What are you on? Two grains of car? One grain, one big grain. Really? I'm thinking probably that bit I put in is going to be gone. I think um, it's cut to where I've got one on there, like while I've got one. Yeah, I'll film the bag. Yeah. Oh, what? You got him? Got one, haven't they? I copied you. Has I got one? I've got one. It's going mental. Is it going chicken oriental? Where's it going? <laughs> it's going right corner. <laughs> it's going right. Go. That's going to have to go for the walk, there, you lad, aren't they? Oh, it's got. Oh, 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 oh. Like it's in some roots. Whoa! Come on, let's go for a walk. Let's go, let's go for a walk. Come on, Take man. your cart for a walk, there. Take your cart to school, there. <laughs> Look at that, lad. Oh, you are. Look at that pole. <laughs> is he is he properly hooked? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh I yeah. I don't know if I hook fish, Matthew. Oh yeah. He was like five million pounds. No, about fifty pounds biggest in here, mate. Fifty pounds. No, it's not really. What is it? About twenty-five pounds. Yeah, it could be twenty-five pounds. Yeah, listen, it could be the old uh, big belly common. The whole bar hippo. <laughs> the old Paul common. Paul belly. Paul belly. And Paul the alien. Paul the alien. That's Matthew Godfrey. Right, I'm gonna go in beast mode. This is where you snap everything. <laughs> Copied you, caught it on a top. Catch him down here. Right, literally here. Right, there. Ah. He's pulling. He's I pulling. think he's a big one, mate. Could be. Oh, he's definitely up to. Ooh, mate. Oh, mate. Got the big belly coming. He's a big one. From Wigan. We're near Wigan, aren't we? Not, we? Half Not half miles away. Out. I tell you what, he's an angry one, isn't he? He is feisty, sir. Have a look at him. Come on, let's have a look at you. Look at the size of that, dude! <laughs> <laughs> that one, baby! He's a big one, isn't he?
I think we might need to get an old looking mat for him. He's a bigger. That's what we came for, mate, isn't it? Get the size of that thing. <laughs> How big on is a, it? On a top kit, it's about 15 pounder, isn't it? He's massive. How good were that? <laughs> I'll get you to hold him up. Top it, yeah. Large portion, Matthew. There he is, the big Lovely bellied one. common, like you said. Cracker, innit? First fish, what a beast. Gorgeous, mate. I thought we can find it. It's only early doors yet. We've got another hour or two, so hopefully. Get a few more. Even That's bigger sure. ones. Look at that. That's what people come to Old Bar for. Cracking fish, there's, mate. There's loads like that in here, though, isn't there? Go on, get him back, brother. Get him back. Get him oh. back. On a top kit. There we go. Dave's got a skimmer on my gear lock. <laughs> what you got, Grandad? Go on, Davey. So go and have a look at it for him. Yeah, go on, get it. Let's, let's include Grandad. So while I'm busy filming old Tank, Grandad's got one. <laughs> what you got? A little bream. A little bream? Couple of phones. Did you catch him on the old top kit line? Right down there. Go on, put him back, mate. Put him back. Right down, literally, you caught him where you're going to put him back. Yeah. See you, Mr. Bream. Oh, well done. Can I have a good now? Right. Cheers, mate. I want you to catch a carp, actually. Have another go. See if you can catch me a carp. Raining now, folks. This is what summer vlog's all about. Raining. Tank's getting his waterproof on. Matt's not got any. Horrible. We get me fleece. Made a ton of new friends. Go on, the boys. The rain set in sadly. Look at this for service though. We've got old granddad holding Broly, haven't we? Cheers, granddad. <laughs> no worries, boys. Got all the secret. He doesn't like being called granddad. Don't like it. As soon as we found out he doesn't like it, yeah. we're just going to call it him all the time. So what's happening then? A little bit of an update. I've just had that cart. What's, you, what's your situation? I've abandoned that. That were crap. Unfortunately, I don't think they like someone standing over the heads of a brolly. I thought they might want to get under it. It's too dry. So I'm going down here now, mate. All right, let's have a little zoom in. Hang on. But I still want to catch one on a top kit before we go. Yeah, that's nice. What are you feeding there, then? Same as what I've fed. But I've fed them two jam sandwiches, an ham and cheese, and a cup of tea. They do love cups of tea at the end. Yeah, they do, don't they? Bit of corn. Oh, that's where you're going wrong, mate. You put your corn at the bottom. Oh, you're joking. Honestly. Right, I'm going to zoom in. What's the oh, final yeah, There's a pellet waggler there. Look, you see it? Try and get it. That looks like one of ours. Shall I get it? Got three big pots in. Next time we see Matthew, he'll have a big pellet waggler on the end. You get it? Go on, I can get it. Go on, go on. Go on. Oh. Right, get it in your pot. Come on, man. Have you got it in your locker? Yay, he's got it! <laughs> oh, he's got it with some line on as well. Oh, he's got some line on. Right, if that's got a fish on. No, he's not going to see up. Oh, that's good. That must be one of yours from a crack off earlier, <laughs> thing. <laughs> hey, it's a guru one. Hey. I don't think they're in stock at the minute. I'm having him. I think you are going to have him. That's all right. I don't care if I don't catch out. I've got me a new waggler. Oh, got his blind out of the way. Oh my god. Oh, a big up Look one. at that, where he put that bait in. Yeah, better have a go there, innit? Go on, put it in there, go on. Chop, chop from the... Look at this, we saved a fish's life there. Like the carp vlog. Oh, there's one there, there isn't there? Oh, definitely, there's one. Tell you what, Grandad, you've been a right service here doing this. You don't like to talk much, don't I, Dave? He's, he likes to mind things. <laughs> Just so you boys don't need subtitles. <laughs> it's true. If you thought we were Northern, wait till you hear David. Hey. I can get one. Oh, I'm right. Pleased about this waggler. Concentrate on your float, Matthew. Sorry. Don't run a vlog as you see. <gasps> Spooked him, look. Oh, stuff coming off. No, he's still there, he's feeding. Oh, rubbish. Dave, uh, would you have caught that? Look at that, I think that were a roach. Suck me corn. 
There's nope. no worse than one nibbling on Ender, is there? No, no, I know what you mean. Just nibbling on Ender. What, what are you doing? What are you, how many you can? Just one. They were a frog. <laughs> that were a frog. It's all going on. I swear down, that were a Police. frog. Oh, lost fuck up. Oops. Nearly dropped my phone, did it? Matt's well, got a new phone, everyone. Right? You know what that? Can you hear that police siren? Yeah. You know what that is? Bad angling police. Bad angling police, aren't they? Coming to arrest us. Oh, they're here now. Bad angling police coming for you. No, I need to get one before they get here. Why are you trying to tap into the water? Oh, yeah. That worked. Done. You know what this is called? This method. Half a method. Half a top kit. Half a top kit. I think I'll get one there. I do. I think you will. There's signs of fish there, isn't there? Gotta be. I think we need to put two big pieces on. I reckon you're fatty with one. Oh. Really coming down now, isn't it, Dave? Yes, it ain't looking as if it's going to go off either. Just to, for clarification, that was it isn't looking as if it's going to go off either. <laughs> Look at all coloured up. Mental, isn't it? Oh, it's chicken oriental, mate. What are we having for tea tonight, lad? Chicken oriental. What are we having for tea, Dave? I guess. Yeah. Right. Well, Looks some. Never had it, you know. What's the idea with that then, you know? Bit of noise. Bring them in. Bring them in. The other side of your head is colouring up the top. Is it? Don't know, man. Seem to come in when you feed some ground bait, and that's about it. Mm. They must be coming straight to it, you know. When I had that one, I literally had it within like 30 seconds of putting ground bait in. Really? Mm. A few moments later. The one there, right on it. Uh oh. Little He's gone over there. I'm just seeing you. Big <laughs> uh, uh, really easy this margin fishing, lads. Well, I'm one for one. Feeding wise, folks, quite straightforward. Just like I said earlier. Keep your calm. Good dollop of ground bait. Very mixed very heavily, give it a little squeeze, sandcastle it in, I'm fishing literally there, oh, let's see if we get one, all that mad in here, chance to catch one. <laughs> Every time I sit down you just come back and get one on. I'll be with you half an hour. Look at size Got the of big that. belly coming again. I think, you know. I think he's a bit bigger than other one mate. Oh, 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 go on. Cradling back nice love. Nice isn't he? Look at him. You happy with him? Yeah, big fish. Rain's Port eased like, a bit. Like mad. Hopefully, Dave said that's the back end of it. He's starting again a little bit. Let's get it back. Nice one, him, eh? Catches the carp, Matt catches skimmers. Marvellous. So then, Matthew, yeah. what rigs are we using today? Strong leg bull. Strong Big rigs. fish in the edge. Um, strong and simple, mate, for margin fishing. We've both got exactly the same rig on. We've got a 12XS spade that are now Teflon coated. Focusing um, on it. Can you see him there? Very tough. I can see him. Beast of an hook. Uh, strong hook. 
O17 Engage Upland, four inches long, with a bulk of number eight micro cubes just above that four inch upland. So why four inch? Because on. when them carp are wafting it about, that bulk will pull it in, and your upland for an up bait stays put on top of your bait. If you fish with like a longer upland or strung out shots. When a big carp comes in, obviously it wafts your rig everywhere, less chance of hooking it. A lot more stable, isn't it? Of course it is. 022 uh, mainline, a 0.4 gram margin diamond, big thick bristle, super strong flow. It's got a glass stem, so that's really stable. When they're wafting it about again, again, that float stays stable. Um, number eight micro cube in between float and hole tip. And that, again, it's all about just holding that bait on top of your little feed area. And I've got a 13 on elastic. I don't like an elastic too um, fierce, especially this time of year. It's not red hot yet. No. Um, and the beauty about hooking them on it when you're having a pleasure session, you get a good old fight. You do. Bit of fun, and isn't it? Got a little bullock in there so you can always get control of them at the net. Yes. That's what it, my old mate. That is the Margin Magician rig that so far has not caught me any carp. You're going to get one now. I am. The next chuck. Come this on, chuck. Then. Well, nearly dark. We've, we've, we've worked hard for this head, haven't we? It's not been easy. It's been a pain in backside. It, it's been a pain in the old boo-boo. But we've got one, finished it. We all went in between them islands. So yes. Yeah. Little tips <laughs> for your tank. You know when you are fishing down edge for big ones? Yeah. You always have your sections like in twos. Yeah, so they're easy to put on. Yeah, you do hook one like then. I, then I hooked that one here. To follow it all the way out to 40 meters, but if you've got your sections just broke down into twos like that, it's a lot easier. Yeah, I like it. Feel a good, yeah, it does feel like a big fish. All right, let's go on that. Out. Looks a good one. You don't have to pull in here, yeah, they're mental, aren't they? Yeah, absolutely mental. What's all I've got left? Chicken or it's all mine's gone, has it? Mm. Mainly because I fed it to me, me duck mates. Oh, he's a big one, isn't he? Yeah, I nice. think he might be a mirror. I didn't see him. Oh, yeah, nice fish. Is that mine? Or oh, was that another no, one? No, no, that was your fish. It's just oh, wrapped up in it. It's wrapped up in yeah. it. Yeah. Nice fish. Common. Yeah, yeah, nice fish. I, think, I don't think they're all massive in here, aren't they? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'd say so. It looks a big one. He's 42.4. Yeah, maybe, maybe a new PB kid. 61.9. Got a 69 pounder. Yeah, nice fish. Yeah, lovely fish. Oh. Well done, mate. It's took your time. Very nice. Yeah. Long common. All are common. Commons, four commons. Not very common though, commons, are they? Not very common, apparently not. Look at that. Look at that. Don't you know them 12 hooks look tiny in their mouth. Like you say you've got a size 12 on. You all do? Yeah, I think so. I'll try. This is the finishing shot, Janice. Is it? Mm. We'll do a little outro by the van. But this is a bye bye now. Yeah, I reckon the last last three fish we've had have been like massive, close it? to 14, 15 pounds. How big is he? Mm, 14 pounds. Look at that. I'd say so. Bit, of a, bit of a warrior, him, isn't he? He's had, a, he's had an hard life, him. Nice one, mate. Well done. Have Love a photo? Of course you will, yeah. Heavy old things, aren't they? Mmm, lovely. There you go, mister. Thank Hi you for a car. little bit of last minute margin action. Where we fished today, Janice? 29. Yeah. 31. Slide on. 31's the known flyer, though. Yeah, the known, yeah. known big fish peg. That's the known flyer. 29. <laughs> very difficult peg. <laughs> very, very oh, tough. Very difficult. Very tough. So folks, I'm sorry to say, Tank decided to catch more carp than me, so I had to push him in, and he's not got back out, unfortunately. <laughs> <laughs> Good that, wasn't it? I really enjoyed it. Good few hours. 
really productive morning testing a few new bits and, and a then, good few hours margin fishing and it's still light and it's about nine o'clock now yeah past nine o'clock time for a good. pint time for a pint well for you four carp you caught three and i'm going to say the smallest one was well into double figures i say like 12 or 13 pounds mm. the smallest one great fishing. which is really good average stamp yeah if you fancy some big carp get yourself on whole bar lake at partridge it's good fun when they pull back they do pull mm. them all in here about that one big one but he doesn't have to pull my arm off loved it nice Cracking. little vlog quick fire one yeah there'll be some uh, more coming sorry it's been a little bit of a short one but we just had to squeeze it in let's squeeze it in we're going to squeeze a pint in potentially come on in bye bye